Hey guys, Robert III, Bad Poncho Outdoors. Uh, we've got a few updates to kind of sit and talk about, um, on my end at least. You'll be seeing a lot more of me and my guys over Bad Poncho Outdoors doing a lot more with, uh, with the Normark brains. Uh, we have kind of signed on with them uh, under the VMC Terminator brand. Um, you guys know that, I mean, I'm, I'm a pretty big Berkeley guy. Um, when it comes to, you know, line, lures, um, you know, and, and, you know, with the flicker rigs and things like that, um, we're going to be transitioning more towards, towards Terminator brand. Um, before I started kind of getting, you know, sponsored up or hooked up, whatever, whatever you want to call it, uh, we, we threw Terminator spinner baits almost exclusively. And this is a while ago because, well, we were throwing painted Terminator blades. And if you know anything about Terminator, well, they got picked up by Normark, and the painted blades are now no longer around. And if you're from the north, the painted blades are the absolute best thing to use because we have, well, our smallmouth, our small population absolutely loves painted blades. Um, and that presents some difficulty, but I think we'll find a way around that. Um... I'm really, really excited over the VMC brand. Um, VMC is one of those companies that, whether they were supporting me or not, I was going to throw VMC hooks. Um, the, the price point is there, so why not? I mean, as as a standard fisherman, a weekend angler, my whole thing is I want to spend the least amount of money that I can while getting the best value. I think I was spending like, Two ninety nine for uh, for thirteen drop shot hooks or sixteen drop shot hooks. I think that's what it was, um, and a size one, which that's just insanity. Um, there, I spoke with our, one of the marketing guys over at over at Normark or Rapala, um, and and they mentioned the goal for VMC was to come in twenty percent under everybody else. Well, mostly under Gamakatsu. Because Gamakatsu is the, the you know like the number one selling brand um, in hooks, so they want to beat them. Obviously, and the way you do that is by doing volume. How do you achieve volume? Lower price, better product. Makes sense. Um, their margins are lower, which is not necessarily a bad thing for the angler. Um, lower margins for companies, the better deal we get as as consumers. Um, and, and this begs a few questions in the industry as well as far as uh, what we're paying for and why we're paying for it. Um, VMC is a good example of fair pricing. Um, they've got a few new products coming out that we can't quite talk about yet um, that I'm really, really excited for. Um, I kind of leaked them a little bit in our classic um, overview, but I can't go too much farther in, into detail. Um, I mean, there's a few things coming out that, uh, that will be interesting. Um, with Randy Howell, um, there's Randy Howell, Ott Defoe, Brandon Polinick, um, all throwing the DT6 and doing so well at the Classic, uh, I know my local store that I work at, um, this is my 9 to 5, we are, I think we're sold out of DT6s now, um. That's just that's just insanity that one tournament can just flip your sails like that. Um, and mind you, we still have 30 inches of ice, and yet we're sold out of DT6s. Um, and that's just that's crazy. Um, the DT6 and the DT series in general is a great running lure. Nothing against it at all. I've thrown them, love them, good product. It's just it's it. It just it's amazing to me seeing how one one product can can turn on or ignite after one event. Um, and if you look at the Dream Shot, if you look at the the Gulp Power, you know the Mar the Marinade uh, for Gulp, um, it, it's just amazing to see what can happen. And that's why these guys do what they do, is because of the attention that they get. Um, and that's the most important thing to remember in tournament fishing. Um, the overall 2014 season is looking good for, for us at Bad Poncho Outdoors. Uh, we are still always looking for more 
more people to work with. Um, so whether you're a company, you're an angler, whether you're an aspiring angler, we want to sit down, we want to talk to you, we want to see what you want to achieve in 2014, if we can help you in any way, um, even if you know, we do it for free. It's just a matter of, of furthering the sport um, and and furthering you know, for each other as anglers. That's what it's all about. Um, you'll notice that through the Bed Pond Shorters banner, we we work with raw fish, we work with advanced angler, we work with wire to fish, um, and we work with uh, a few other companies as well that that aren't quite as big as those other guys. Um, Chris McDonald's Fishing is one of those guys, local guys that we try to we try to work with here and there. Um, I mean, the whole goal of Bed Pond Shorters and what I do. Is to bring the industry together. That's why you see, I'm with Pure Fishing, and with Normark, the two biggest companies in fishing, and somehow we're able to work with both of them, um, and that's what it's all about. But I'm Robert to a third Bad Poncho Outdoors. Thanks for checking in.